Hi there guys, um, just a video to say I'm back after a week off from making videos. Uh, I have been painting and sorting some other stuff out as well, some personal stuff. Um, yeah, but uh, I've been watching a lot of videos on YouTube again, just a bit of um, inspiration for a new project. I'll try, and, well, hopefully it's going to be a new project, money. Uh, depending on money situation and whatever. Um, basically, as you know, I'm doing a Dark Angels Army. That's still ongoing, uh, very slowly. And now I'm going to turn my hands to a Dark, uh, not Dark, uh, Iron Hands Army. Uh, basically, you've been watching, like I say, a few videos on YouTube, uh, especially uh, a guy called, I think it's called Sin Zaren, who does um, Iron Hands. And that's basically the inspiration behind well my army or oh, as, as close as I can get to a, a full army with a money situation. Uh, so what I'm going to show you now is uh, some of these first. So I'm going to serve it ours. Let's see if it focuses in. There we go. Uh, bases, I'm still trying to work out which style of base I'm going to do whether it be on a urban or wherever, so ignore the bases really. But it's just, um, yeah. Basically wanted really dark, dirty looking miniature, but the skin, yeah, it's come out looking like skin, but I, I wanted it to be a lot paler, but didn't have the colors, etc. to make it. I mean, if any of you have seen the movie Star Trek and stuff like that, and you see the Borg, and that's like the, the inspiration behind it. The uh, skin is very pale. This is, you know, that's the look I'm trying to go for, but I don't think it's worked out. But you know, you learn from your mistakes, I suppose. Uh, so there's that one. Um, let's show you this one next, and we've thrown all the words for now. Show you this one again. Bit of a dark, like I say, the skin hasn't turned out how I'd wanted. It's not bad, obviously, but it hasn't turned out too bad. Um, not too, I'm not too sure on uh, how the iron hands, what you could put in an army. I mean, you've got, you've got all this new mechanic of stuff coming out and I might try and incorporate that into it somehow. But yeah, I'm, the minis I'm going for, well these are obviously from Games Workshop, but the minis I'm going to attempt, uh, well, try and get are uh, from Forge World, obviously. The, I like the way that their marines look con, instead of Games Workshop. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'd quite happily buy Games Workshop tactical squads and whatever and paint them up with that, but... I'm also thinking I might have painted like you know the clothes the clothes on these guys like I shouldn't have painted them blue and red and the other one yellow. You know, it just doesn't look looks a bit too cartoony. And I wouldn't expect that uh, like someone in the iron hands to have like bright coloured clothes, seems though they are a black armour. But yeah, if I put them together with some comments they look like power rangers. All I need now is a green one, which I have a spare one. Obviously, I have the other one I haven't painted up yet, so that'll might turn out green. So there's them. Uh, got found these in my bits box, so they'll go in it as well. If the, well, they're only servo skulls, you don't need to focus on them really. Uh, this is what I've been working on really. Again, the base isn't finished. <coughs> And I've said before in my videos, I cannot paint black to save my life, so doing an Iron Hands army is going to be a bit tricky. But what I've tried to do here, if it's pick it up, let's try and focus it, is uh, do a bit of light, lighting, like source lighting type thing, uh, on this thing on his backpack. It's like the glow coming out. I know I haven't done it right, but it's like, say, a first attempt. And it's a uh, Sinzarin on uh, 
YouTube does his iron hands with green, like glowy eyes and stuff. It's not focusing. And that's what I've tried to do, I have a green glow effect. I mean, I've looked on the internet, you can do blue, red and all that, but green just looks more, looks better, stands out better. So, uh, some of you may have noticed too, that on his backpack, focus away. I'm getting a bit frustrated with this now. Uh, on his backpack, he is missing something off here. Uh, it was on, like a grabber thing, I don't know, but it snapped with it being um, crappy Games Workshop resin. Literally just snapped in my hand, because my hand was warm, bent it, snapped off. Uh, yeah, but I've went for like a really dirty, dark look, besides some obviously the uh, green glow. This isn't... Oh, there you go. Uh, but I've just basically gone black and then put that straight on top. But now, hindsight, uh, I should have like obviously done a darker green, then gone lighter and lighter instead of just putting a light green straight on top of black. But like I say, it's all a learning curve for me. This. Uh, Yes, there's that one. Um, now, the last model I'm going to show you here is from my Dark Angels army, which is this one here. Um, yep, yeah, he's missing his hand here, because I haven't decided what type of weapon I want to put on him. Uh, Obviously I'll paint that separate. It did just have a bolt pistol on it, a bolt gun, sorry, but it again snapped off because I dropped it like a daft sod that I am. Uh, but then I thought, well, it's actually made quite a clean break, you know, the, so I can just attach another another weapon of sorts. Like I said, I'll just have to decide which one I want to do. Uh, yeah, so that's what I've been working on. Uh, but hopefully, once I save the pennies, I can get myself some tactical squads from Forge World. And, well, not this one, obviously. That's for another army, but this and his servitors will go in the army. Hopefully. Yeah, but I'm quite proud of how I've actually done this black armour. Just basically, just uh, silver chipping, basically all the way around the armour makes it look like your battle battle damage and stuff like that. So you don't have to worry about highlighting the uh, armour with greys and all that type of stuff. So I'm quite happy how I've managed to do that. Like I say, the base. I need to obviously sort it out, but yeah, that's not a problem. Alright uh, guys, we're coming up to uh, well, we're coming up to nine minutes for this video. God, that's a long video. Um, yeah, obviously like, comment, subscribe. Please subscribe, I need all them subscribers. It means a lot. Alright guys, see you later. Have a good one.